Hello and welcome to this Rapid Deploy version of 4.0 How To Guide. My name is Richard Bettison and today we're going to look at exporting and importing projects between instances of Rapid Deploy. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and log into this instance of demo.midvision.com. And we're going to go and find the project that we want to export. And I'm going to export this setOS configuration for WAS base on AWS. I'm going to download that. So I just click on that download button, confirm that I want to download that project, and that project has been downloaded. I'm now going to go ahead and log into a local instance of Rapid Deploy that I'm running on my desktop. And again, I'm going to go to Resources Projects. Now I'm just going to click on this Upload button. I'm going to choose the file, which is the one we've just downloaded. I'm going to open that and click on the Import button. OK. I'm going to follow the wizard to actually import this project. You'll see here that the project root directory is set to use as Richard Betterson downloads, and that's the location of my um, Midvision home on my local machine. And Rapid Deploy, when it exports and import a project, will, if possible, switch the MV home from the old exported location to the new imported location so that you don't need to update the project root directory. And so I can just click Next here. And again here, I can click Next. And the same on the file system. I just click Next, Next again, and now I just import this project. OK, and that import's completed. We can see that import here. I click on that. We can see the orchestration. We can see the targets that have been imported, and there's just one target that's been imported. The definition of that server has also been imported with the target servers to connect to. Now, of course, I might need to change these uh, for my new instance of Rapid Deploy, but everything that was in the old project is now imported into this new project. OK, so that really shows how we can export a project from one instance of Rapid Deploy and import it into another instance of Rapid Deploy for instant use. Thank you very much for joining me today and uh, I hope to see you again next time. Thank you.